Here is an explanation of the SCL Season 1 Tournament Format. Since we have 32 teams with a wide spread of players with different skill levels, we will need to split these teams into two divisions. We'll start the season off with a Swiss system format as a placement qualifier for all the 32 teams to participate in. Every team and qualifiers would play 5 matches in total to be able to be placed in their respective division. After every team plays 5 matches, the top 16 teams would be placed in the major division and the bottom 16 teams get placed in the minor division. To give you guys a better understanding on how the Swiss bracket system format works, let me show you a demonstration with just 4 teams to explain this bracket a little easier. All teams would be given a random opponent for the first round of qualifiers. The teams that win their first round will be labeled as 1-0 and the teams that lose their first round will be labeled as 0-1. Moving forward, every match a team plays will be against another opponent with the same match record as them. For example, the teams that are 1-0 will then face another team that is 1-0 for the second round of qualifiers. And the team that is 0-1 will face another team that is 0-1 for the second round. Matches would then proceed with teams playing against each other until every team has completely played 5 matches in the qualifiers. That would mean that by the end of the qualifiers, the top 16 teams would at least have won 3 matches and the bottom 16 teams would at least have lost 3 matches by the end of qualifiers. Overall, with this system, every match you play, you get closer and closer with playing against teams that are relative to your skill level. So your only match that would be dramatically unfair would only be your first one. Now, after the qualifiers are done, then a major and minor division will be created the following week and will be the start of the group stages for both divisions. Each division will play in a double elimination bracket groups format. The 16 teams would be split into 4 bracket groups making each group contain 4 teams that will be going against each other in a double elimination bracket within their own group. All teams would be seeded into this bracket based on where they placed from their qualifiers. Teams will then play each other to advance further into the bracket and if a team loses once they will still have a second chance to advance, but if they lose again in the loser's bracket, then they are out of the season. There will be two teams from each group that will make it to the end and will advance into the playoffs for their respective division. So this means that one team will qualify from the winner's side of the bracket and one team that will qualify from the loser's side of the bracket from each group. This would mean eight teams will qualify for SEL playoffs for each division. The last stage of the season would be the major and minor playoffs, which would be played in a regular double elimination bracket the eight teams. Teams will then play each other to advance forward into the bracket. And if a team loses twice, then their season is over. Once playoffs is concluded, we'll be left with two winners to be crowned as SCL season champions. One team as the major division winner and one team as the minor division winner. Thank you guys so much for sticking around to the end of this video. If you guys have any questions about how this tournament format works, feel free to comment down below or message me in the SCL Discord at SirDankNom and I'll be happy to answer you guys' questions. If you guys haven't yet, make sure to subscribe to this channel and follow Official CAA on Twitch to keep up to date on more of our competitive PF content. Other than that, thank all of you again for watching and I'll see you guys later.